Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sonali, if you guys didn't already know me. And today, I'm going to be showing you guys what I got my little for initiation. When you join a sorority, you are a new member, and then once you get initiated, you are an official member of the sorority that you joined. After our initiation, we usually give our littles this big basket with all these sorority gifts. Baskets aren't usually this big, but I personally just really wanted to spoil my little, so I kind of... Did some damage, but I'm so excited for her to see it all and she's gonna be so excited. So the first thing, the biggest thing that takes up like all of the basket basically is this blanket and I got it embroidered. It just says Katie Valentina on it and it is literally the world's most softest, fluffiest, blanket ever. It's by the brand Better Homes and I've actually had like one like this and like naps with this blanket are the best naps in the world and I'm pretty sure it was only $15 at Walmart and then to get it embroidered I went to Blossom which is a boutique really close to UCF if you are around this area it's right next to Boston Coffee House I actually just got a job there as their campus rep and a sales associate and I'm just gonna be helping them out with their social media so I'm so excited about that so if you're in the Orlando area and looking for gifts to buy your friends like even for birthdays the whole store is not sorority like it's just like one little section but they have a lot to choose from compared to like some of the stores around here they like only carry like a notepad that says KD on it but Blossom carries like cups they do embroidery for blankets they have notepads they have signs so check it out if you're in the Orlando area and come say hi it only costs $15 to embroider this at Blossom I don't know if you guys watch my vlog but I was making these letters over summer because I wanted to put it in her initiation basket and Ryan's grandpa actually helped us like cut this out like literally in his woodshed so that's really cool and basically it's like all white but then it has like gold I painted it gold on the sides I don't really know if I like want to paint this part I just like don't want to mess it up because I think it's like kind of cool just very simple but has the gold on the side so not really sure what to do with it still. Next I got this marble makeup bag from The Social Life. It is a Greek store online and it's like a pencil pouch material which I was not expecting. I kind of thought it was going to be like a glossy type of finish but it's actually a fabric so it could probably get dirty fast but I just thought the print was so cute because marble is like so in. Then I got this bright green fanny pack for her. She could wear it to like philanthropy events such as Nython which is like a dance marathon that we do here at UCF. So I thought this was really cool. This is also from The Social Life. Then when I went to visit Ryan in Athens, Georgia, I got this water bottle from UGA Spirit and it has capital to written in gold. I actually bought this for myself because I really wanted a water bottle that kept my ice water cold all day and this does it so well it's like crazy but the only thing is that this is actually painted on so mine kind of came off already which sucks because I thought it was really really cute but oh well then I have this Katie keychain I think I got it in my initiation basket but I just don't really use it so I'm going to give it to her then I got this tote bag and it just says Katie on it and it's a look like long chomp tote bag I got this bag at UGA spirit as well and I was kind of hoping that the KD would be bigger. They didn't really ask me what size I wanted it to be, which kind of sucked because I didn't want it to be this small on this big giant bag. I thought she could use a really cute tote bag because in college you're carrying your laptop around, charger, books, anything like that. So I thought this would be a really useful gift. And this was only like maybe $35 and then I had to get it embroidered. So maybe like 40 or 45 which isn't that bad for a bag like this because it is really nice quality then I got her this hat from the social life as well it's just a plain Kappa Delta gray hat I wanted to get it in a different color they didn't really have that many colors to choose from which sucked but I feel like this would match a lot of stuff so then I got this t-shirt online in the summer and it's a comfort colors t-shirt it's just in a medium, you know, just like a basic Kappa Delta shirt. Then I got this muted green Comfort Colors t-shirt on The Social Life as well. This is going to be so comfortable for when she's just chilling at KD. Today, I actually got this cup for her. It says Little Sis. It kind of looks like a Kate Spade tumbler, but it's like sorority related. And I also have the Big Sis one, so we can be like twinning. And they're from Alexandra and Company, but I got it at Blossom. Then I have this Damn It doll. I was gifted this in senior year. And it's just been sitting around, so I thought it'd be cute to put in her basket. It says, whenever things don't go so well, 
and you want to hit the wall and yell, here's a little dammit doll that you can't do without. Just grasp it firmly by the legs and find a place to slam it, and as you whack the stuffing out, yell damn it, damn it, damn it. So whenever she's stressed out, she can think of me and just whack this doll around, and I don't know, I just thought it was like a cute little knickknack to put in there. Then of course, I have the beloved car decal. Personally, I was the most excited about putting a car decal on my car when I got initiated. Next, I got the Katie Lavalier, and it's already on a chain and everything. I know some lavaliers don't come with chains, but I just got mine with a chain because then she can wear it as soon as possible. Then I got this white rose to put in her basket so we can take pictures with it afterwards because the white rose is one of Capadelta's symbols. And the last one is kind of random, but it's the new Naked palette. It's the Naked Ultimate Basics, all matte, all naked. I'm so excited to give this to her. She has been wanting me to teach her how to do like makeup and eyeshadow and stuff. And she's been talking about wanting like one of the Urban Decay palettes. like. I think she wanted the Naked too, but this is like the newest palette and I really wanted to get her this one because I feel like matte colors are the best for beginners. So I'm really excited for her to open this one. So that's it of this sorority haul. I hope you guys really enjoyed it and got some ideas of what to get your littles and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!